Hello again, this is 3D Modeler on YouTube and welcome to this second, er, uh, sorry, fourth tutorial and now we're getting into some of the more interesting stuff so we have the man that we created in the previous one and we'll now add a modifier to the man to make it look more smooth I'll go here to the modifiers list I'll drop down and I'll see all these different modifiers that you can add to um, to your man and in this case I'll select the mesh smooth modifier and as you can see it becomes much more smooth and much more um, organic like so what I'm going to do now I just want to edit it a bit this I'll do this very very fast um, you know how to do this so there shouldn't be any need for showing you how to do this I'll just um, before I go in and edit this model uh, I'll just click this small bulb here uh, out from um, mesh smooth this will go back to the previous one that we had before we applied the modifier and I'll just pause the, uh, the video here and I'll just make the changes and see you back in a second so hi again um, as you can see <laughs> the model got a bit more complex than it was before and so but don't worry this is um, created done by it's done by creating everything the way that you saw me do in the other tutorials so if you take a little while half an hour ten minutes you could get it to look something like this as you can see here I added two more lines to the arms where the joints are on both sides and to the legs where the joints are there so now I'm going to as you can see here I'm in the editable poly that's the one that's highlighted and to edit the one this one with the mesh smooth modifier active I go down here and press this small button and as you can see you are able to see all the uh, vertices but you are still able to modify those with the modifier applied so I'm just going to edit this part here and as you can see I selected these four so that when I narrow these in it's only those are selected and I'll actually move these in a bit further like so so now it looks more like the bar bottom <laughs> the butt here and I'll just, just select this and move this out back a bit like so to get a nice round shape so basically this is how you add a modifier to make it look smoother and you can actually convert this into a edible poly again and you'll see that you get many more vertices than you got before but this is because the modification is have have been applied to your model so so that's basically what I wanted to talk about now in the next tutorial I'll show you how to make uh, a put a skeleton inside it to animate this model um, before we do that I'll just go and hit C to undo the merging and I'll see you on the next tutorial this is a 3D modeler on YouTube thanks for watching